All right, cool. I've just um, spent the afternoon because um, I thought it'd be nice to be able to just uh, use the Face AR phone capture and uh, just record on my phone and then just email me myself that data and uh, and then just assign that data actually to the MetaHuman GUI um, control system so that then I've basically got sofa facial mocap going on. So um, yeah, here's the results. Um, built a little importer. Basically, you get your CSV file uh, exported out of your Face AR Live Link um, app. So you just need to build a little importer, and uh, yeah, brings it into uh, the MetaHuman rigs, which is kind of nice. And uh, the cool thing about that is, obviously, if you've got um, layers, you can you know go in and tweak the animation after the uh, after the fact. Yeah, pretty uh, pretty happy with that. That's pretty cool. Um, certainly for the eye gaze and look ats and um, just giving some life to the eyes. Um, the um, face AR is awesome for that. Obviously, it falls a little bit flat on the um, on the solving around the lip area, but in conjunction with the metahumans, it's not too bad. So uh, it's nice that the metahumans does give you that extra bit, little bit of extra fidelity that you can go through and fine tune if you want to. But yeah, this is a nice step from you know just doing all the live stuff in Unreal. Um, ideally, we just want to have that data in Maya and on a rig that we can um, tweak and adjust. So yeah, happy with that. Just wanted to share the share the progress.